tonight, new at 11, a Rocky Hill man was assaulted by four men who were trying to steal his car right from his driveway. The Pinpoint News Tracker showing you the neighborhood here. This is on Valley View Drive in Rocky Hill. This is right off Maple Street. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Hector Molina reports from Rocky Hill after talking with the victim's wife and neighbors. Said there were a couple cop cars and we weren't really sure what happened because there's normally not anything like that in our neighborhood. Gina Brennan is one of many residents of Valley View Drive now shaken up after her neighbor was assaulted while confronting a young man who was trying to steal a car out of his driveway. Police say when the burglar was confronted, three more suspects jump out of a nearby car and also attack the victim. The four suspects then left in what police are describing as a four-door blue or black Mercedes sedan. The victim's family told me off camera that he was brought to the hospital but did not have any serious injuries. This all is an incident of concern to Douglas Russell, the victim's next door neighbor who witnessed the aftermath. Uh, he's, he's a great guy and that they have a great family and I was really concerned he looked a little bit distressed. Um, and I was going to talk to him today, but I didn't happen to see him. But um, yeah, it was just, you know, it was a little distressing. Police say the incident was recorded on the homeowner surveillance camera. The suspects are identified as four young men who are all wearing masks. Neighbors say the attempted theft is a rising trend they've noticed in surrounding communities. I have a ring here or, you know, like a video camera. And um, we have a community, and there's been kind of an increased incidence of uh, these carjackings over the, I'd say, over the last five years or so. I, I think the rules need to be tight, tightened against these people that are, uh, that are doing the crimes. Now, the homeowners did decline to share that security camera footage with Eyewitness News, but police are still asking anyone with information on this incident to give them a call. In Rocky Hill tonight, Hector Molina, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.